At St. Joseph's College, students have continued to participate and persevere and aspire to excellence and as such, sports continues to be an integral part of college life and will continue to do so in the future. We started the year off with the annual swimming carnival held at Millen Bay. We had great participation from all students in attendance. Murphy House gained their second swimming carnival win in a row and Macaulay cheered the house down to win the Spirit Trophy. Later in the year, we gathered as a school to celebrate the Athletics Carnival. The community gathered to support and cheer for the participants, embodying the spirit of sportsmanship and determination. The costumes, the sense of unity and camaraderie within the house groups created memories that will last a lifetime. The carnival turned out to be a successful affair, marked by strong attendance and enthusiastic participation and even an exciting win for Macaulay House. We quickly came around to the final carnival, the cross country. We congratulate Murphy House on winning the final carnival of the year. Laughter echoed through the air as students and teachers embraced the colourful chaos, turning the colour run event into a joyful and messy spectacle where faces were streaked with colourful pigments. The colour explosion was a wonderful opportunity to merge sport with the mission of our college by sharing unforgettable memories and supporting Interact Schaefer A Cure initiative. In 2023, we again had large numbers of students participating and experiencing various levels of success in the school sporting system at district, regional and state championships. We are thrilled to recognise the massive growth in students representing our school in sport, going from 37 students to 76 students representing the college in Darling Downs teams this year and increasing from 2 to 11 students representing Queensland. We congratulate Jackson Stewart, Maddox Jackson, Bridie Nicol, Sienna Dulu, Bailey Deacon and Blaise Prendergast. We would also like to congratulate Heidi Zimmerle, Claire Zimmerle, Dominique Henningsen and Tamika Dine who represented our school as Queensland umpires and referees. Congratulations to those students who were selected to represent our college at Toowoomba District, Regional, State and National Carnivals. Across 2023, students participated in various gala days and carnivals with great success. In netball, the college participated in Laura Geitz Cup, Junior and Senior Vicky Wilson, Wednesday Night Competition, the Mercy Shield and the Quizzing Carnival. We would like to mention and congratulate the first ever entered boys team in the Senior Vicky Wilson Competition, who did a fantastic job finishing in third place. In Rugby League, our boys and girls teams continue to develop their skills through various carnivals. In Girls Rugby League, the college participated in the Karen Murphy Cup, Confraternity Cup and the new competition Clydesdales Cup. All three of our girls teams made the finals for the Clydesdales Cup and we came home with a clean sweep of all three wins. An excellent achievement for the college and for Girls Rugby League. The boys team played in the annual Wednesday night competition, Mercy Shield and the Gala Days which all helped them prepare for the Confraternity Cup. In the tough week of Confraternity, our boys played excellent football, improving every day and even winning the Spirit of Confraternity trophy. The girls team managed to make it into a grand final and win the Confraternity Cup trophy. In touch football, we played in the Southwest Swans Carnival, which is a lead up to the Toowoomba All Schools competition and the major All Schools Cup held at the Gold Coast, where we had six teams entered this year. In the Toowoomba All Schools, the Open Mixed team managed to bring home the win over Our Lady of the Southern Cross in Dolby. In football, the junior teams competed in the Bill Turner Cup and the junior girls were runners up in this competition. The senior teams contested for the SSI Red Lion Cup where our girls were successful in winning this competition. In hockey, we played in All Schools Cup for boys and girls and this year the girls were awarded runners up. Friday night basketball competition held in Term 1 was again a very successful inter-school competition. Students then participated in the senior and junior AAG competitions and progressed to the junior and senior CBSQ basketball tournaments held at the Gold Coast. The 9 and 10 and Open girls made it all the way to the final in the Friday night competition but were defeated in the final quarter. Without the support and dedication of our teachers, parents and guardians, the sporting opportunities provided at St Joseph's College would not nearly be as fantastic and memorable as they have and continue to be. Congratulations to all sporting individuals and teams for aspiring to excellence and showing participation and perseverance in all they do at St Joseph's College. <laughs>